In this video, we are going to show you how to install your Sauna Wellness Pro 10 three-person sauna. Please take note of the timestamps listed on screen in case you need to jump to a specific point in the video. Before getting started, you are going to need at least two people to successfully complete this installation. You will also need a step stool or a step ladder for accessing the top of the sauna, as well as a Phillips head screwdriver or drill for fastening the sauna door handle. It is recommended to take the items out of each box before assembly to make the process as easy as possible. The contents of each box should be as follows. Box A should contain the front wall with the door and the rear salt tile wall. Box B will contain the left and right walls. Box C will contain the ceiling and base of the sauna, along with the door handle and O2 ionizer. Lastly, box D will contain the two bench pieces. Decide where your infrared sauna should go, and place the side of your floor panel with the electrical cord closest to the wall. Make sure to also allow six inches of clearance from the wall for the installation. The first wall to place will be the back wall. This is the wall with the electrical ports and the salt tiles. Set the wall down on the outside of the floor molding and have someone hold it into place. While installer one supports the wall, have installer two retrieve the right wall panel. This is the wall with a single vertical wooden ridge at the bottom. Place the wall down on the outside of the floor molding and ensure that the fitting is correctly aligned. Then, secure the two walls together using the three corner buckles, locking them into place. While installer one supports the back and right wall, installer two should install the left wall, following the same procedures as before, ensuring the walls are aligned and securing the walls with the buckles, locking them into place. Next, you will want to install the seating bench while the front of the sauna is still open and accessible. The first piece to install is the piece with the heating element. Position the piece horizontally with the heater vents towards the open end of the sauna. Fit the bench piece into the molding grooves and then plug the power cords into the rear wall outlet. Next, slide the top of the bench piece in, resting it on top of the back's horizontal ridge and on top of the bench piece with the heating element. If done properly, your bench should be fully secured into place and you won't need any additional hardware to support the bench. Taking care not to let the door swing open, set the panel on the front side of the base, paying attention that the logo is facing outward. Then again, just like before, secure the wall into place using the three buckles on each side of the door panel. Using a Phillips head screwdriver or a drill with a Phillips drill bit, remove the two screws that are holding the handle pieces together. Feed the screws through the interior handle into the glass holes from the interior side of the door. Line up the exterior handle with the screws, and with your drill or screwdriver, drive the screw into place just tight enough to hold the handle secure and flush to the door. Be sure not to over tighten the screw to avoid any risk of cracking the glass. Using two people, lift a ceiling panel onto the four walls with the finished side down and the wiring side facing up. Make sure to place any wiring attached to the walls on the outside of the sauna. Along the sides and the back end of the sauna are pre-cut holes to feed the necessary wires through to the ceiling panel. Feed the wires through these pre-cut holes. Starting on the left side of the ceiling, connect the white multi-pin cables together, followed by the black cable, then the white cable. Connect the power cables together. Then, take the white LED cable and plug that into the center circuit board. On the back side of the ceiling, plug the white LED cable into the center board. Then connect the red wires together. Lastly, connect the power cables together and move over to the right side of the sauna. On the right side of the sauna, take the two white LED cables and plug them into the center board. After that, connect the power cables together. Ensure that all wires are connected properly and that there are no stranded wires left disconnected. Lastly, install your O2 ionizer. To do this, plug it into the cable attached to the ceiling, and using the peel and stick adhesive, place it in your desired spot, then affix it to the ceiling with the included screws. After following along with this video, your sauna should now be completed and ready to use. If you have any questions regarding our infrared saunas, reach out to us at our website at wellness-usa.com or give us a call at 1-800-1-800.
445-8418.